In this video, we will be doing some practice questions on prime factorization. So let's get started with our first question. 2940 can be expressed as a product of primes. Now keep in mind that any given number in this world can be expressed as a product of its prime factors. So these are your options. Okay, we will need to find the prime factors of 2940. So let's do it. 2940 and see if it is divisible by the lowest prime number 2. Yes, it is divisible by 2. So I'd write 2 here and here the quotient of this division 2940 divided by 2 gives us 1470. Now again find the prime factors of 1470. So it is divisible by 2 again. So 2 on the right hand side I would get 735. Now 735 is not divisible by 2. So you take the next prime number which is 3. It is divisible by 3. So I write 3 here. The answer here would be 245. 245 is divisible by 5. It is not divisible by 2 neither by 3. It is divisible by 5. So on the right hand side you know, I get 5 goes to 20. 5 9 is 45. So 49 is uh, it is not divisible by 5 so neither 2 3 so it would be 7 into 7 now we have a prime number here so we would stop so the prime factors of 2940 are 2 2 3 5 7 and 7 so i can write it as 2 into 2 into 3 into 5 into 7 so uh, it matches the first option so the answer is option number 1 let's move on to question number 2 Reduce this fraction to its lowest terms. Basically, it is asking you the ratio between these two numbers. Now, let me give you a hint here. You know that any number can be expressed as a product of its prime factors. So, what you can do is express the numerator and the denominator as a product of their prime factors, and hopefully, you can cancel out terms. Let us find the prime factors of 2850. So, 2850, we would start with the lowest prime number 2. 2850 divided by 2 gives us 1425. Now 1425 is not divisible by 2, it is divisible by 3. It gives us 475. 475 is not divisible by 2, neither 3, so it is divisible by 5. So 5 times 95 gives us 475. Now 95 is again not divisible by 2 or 3, it is divisible by 5. So 5 times 19 is 95. 19 is a prime number, so we stop. Now the prime factors of 3150. It is divisible by 2. So 3150 divided by 2 gives us 1575. 1575 is not divisible by 2. It is divisible by 3. And we would get 525 as the answer of this division. Now 525 is divisible by 3. So 3, um, 175 times is 525. Now 175 is not divisible by 2, 3. It is divisible by 5. So 5 times 35 is 175. And 35 is 5 times 7. 7 is a prime number, so we again stop here. We can write 2850 by 3150 as, on the numerator, the product of prime factors of 2850 which is 2 into 3 into 5 into 5 into 19 and on the denominator we have 2 into 3 into 3 into 5 into 5 into 7 so we can cancel out terms here a lot of them 2 gets cancelled out 3 gets cancelled out both of the 5s get cancelled out so we have 19 here and 7 into 3 is 21. So the answer is 19 by 21. So we have option number B as the right answer. Question 3. How many prime factors does the number 1095 contain? So the question is quite easy. Just find out the prime factors of 1095. So 1095 um, it is not divisible by 2, it is divisible by 3. I hope you know the divisibility tests. Uh, if not, watch previous videos. 
So it is divisible by 31095 and the quotient of this division we get as 365. Now 365 is not divisible by 2, neither it is divisible by 3. So it is divisible by 5. So 5 times 73 is 365. And uh, 73 is a prime number. So we have to stop. So 1095 can be written as 3 into 5 into 73. And these are 3 prime factors. So our answer is option C. Now the final question, question 4. Which of the following has least number of devices? So again let me give you a hint here. It is asking you the number which has the least number of factors. Let's find out the prime factors of each and every number here. So 27 is not divisible by 2, it is divisible by 3. So here comes 9, 3 9 to 27, 9 again, 3 times 3 is 9. Let's do for 90. 90 is divisible by 2. 245 is 90. 45 is divisible by 3. 315 is 45. Now 15, 3 times 5 is 15. 84. 2, 42 times 2 is 84. So 42 is divisible by 2. So 2, 2 is 4, 2, and 2 times 21 is 42 and 3 times 7 is 21. 29 is a prime number so it has only one prime factor which is 29. That's it. So the answer is right here 29 because it has the least number of devices. It has only two devices actually 1 and 29.